Ah, my alma mater. The most prestigious spellcasting institution in all of Zork. And I was first in my class, too. If you want to get in, you're going to have to pass the entrance exam. The three pillars, they test your aptitude for visualization, pattern recognition, and clicking. GUE Tech, Eastlands. Boy, this takes me back. The glory days of enchanting. I can't remember a damn thing. Snacks, sweet snacks. What a welcome sight to the road-weary adventurer. Hmm. I think some of these were here my freshman year. And the hallway becomes a small way. This is an emergency magicatronic message from the Enchanter's Broadcasting System. I am the wizard, Bellbuzz. This is probably not a test. Should a tyrannical anti-magic despot have in fact eliminated magic from the Empire, you 
must find the following three lost magic artifacts. If you find them, magic will return. You must find the Coconut of Quendor. It contains the magic knowledge of the Circle of Enchanters. Knowledge enough to fill an entire coconut. Hidden before magic was banished from the realm. It holds the power of high magic and makes, I'm told, one heck of a piña colada. The wizard Yigail set sail into the Great Sea with it in 966 G.U.E. It was never heard from again. You must find the Skull of Yorick, which contains the soul of deep magic. The powerful skull has fueled wars, raised empires, toppled cities, and through it all remained quite shiny. The skull was stolen by a pack of Grues near the historic White House in the year 948. You must find the missing cube of foundation, one of the 17 building blocks which form our existence. The cube that contains the power of middle magic was allegedly won in a game of double fanucci by the scoundrel Antharia Jack, proprietor of a gambling hall in Port Fusel. As the sources were intoxicated in the extreme, this information has never been verified. Search out the time tunnels. This is the sole purpose for which we built them eons ago. This has been an emergency magicatronic message from the Enchanter's broadcasting system. This has not been a test. If this had been a test, an annoying tone would have sounded. The tone would have sounded very much like this. As you'll notice, the university doesn't exist in our space-time. It's in a parallel dimension called the Ethereal Plains of Atri, which we sorcerers share with snack cakes, former child stars, and people who own ferrets. Hey, free dirt! Let's dematerialize, shall we?
That's more like it. Now, unless I'm mistaken, all you have to do is pick the place you want to go to, wait at the edge of the platform, and assume crash position. I guess I should warn you, the thing about the underground underground is um, that there were a few cutbacks and then a few more. And then, well, they just never got around to installing the brakes. That really clears the sinuses. Hey, Slim, what you reading? How to hypnotize yourself. Guess it worked. Watch out. Old Scratch plays for high stakes. 500 Zorkmids against eternal damnation. What I'm trying to say is maybe you ought to save. Ching! 500 Zorkmans. Can you hear it? Thousands of voices lamenting some hideous fate. Or maybe it's just me. It's a direct line to the Commissioner. Thank you for calling the Hades Shuttle Service Courtesy Phone. Since the dawn of time, your choice for crossing over into the afterlife. To skip a message at any time, press 4. 
This service has recently undergone a retrofitting to ensure full ease of abuse, customer dissatisfaction, and user unfriendliness while inefficiently bringing you, the recently deceased, to your final destination. Before crossing, you'll need to answer a few simple questions using the touch tone pad. Press 1 for the list of questions. To press 3, please press 7. To hear these options again, call back and listen to them again. To press 4, hit the pound key. To return to the main menu, you're already there. Press 8 to press 1. To wait on hold, stay on the line. To press 6, press 2. For a list of numbers, count to 10. To press 7, press 5. To hear the answers, press 6. To press 0, press the star key. To hear these options backwards, press 9. To press the star key, press 0. Press 3 if you really want to. For all other inquiries, please, blah, 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 blah. The answers are as follows. Press 1 for yes. Press 3 for rather stinky. Press 6 for no. Press 9 for a great deal of cheese. Or press the star key for what is all this? I just want to call the damn shuttle. Is that so much to ask? To return to the main menu, return to the main menu. Press 1 for the list of questions. To press 3, please press 7. To hear these options again, call back and listen to them again. To press 4, hit the pound key. To return to the main menu, you're already there. Press 8 to... Five hundred Zorkmids. Let's just stuff those in a handy little sack, shall we?
I hate it when that happens. That's Yannick's locker. That rat ant was my roommate here for three terms, before he became the pastor of disaster up in the above ground. He would have failed out first term if it weren't for me. A Prozork tablet. This stuff will mellow anything out. Animal, vegetable, or mineral. Look at this! Cheat notes! Crib sheets! He may run the Empire, but he's not quite Mensa material. Where were you keeping that? Suck from Frobo's Electric. We don't make things that suck. We make things that suck permanently.
Warning, presence of cola beverage detected. Let's find a safe home for this stuff, okay? These rocks are about to pop in a very big way and I don't want to be next to them when they do. There you go, crisis averted. Warning, warning. This candy will self-destruct in 45 seconds. Caution, Zork rocks have been corrupted. This candy will self-destruct in 30 seconds. Danger, danger, meltdown it's is stuck. imminent. This candy will self-destruct in 15 seconds. It's stuck. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Look, this is my locker. That's my stuff. My books and my papers and my, my. Oh, I guess I should have washed those gym shorts. My student ID. Fortunately, I cast the turn embarrassing photo invisible spell on it. <laughs> My lantern sense is tingling, warning me of danger. Oh, and your sword's glowing too. Yee, Graham. <laughs>